So guys, welcome back to another video. Today is going to be just a quick one based on the brand new SBCs. We've got the Sound as the Grave one and the Coven of Witches. And in this video today, I'm going to show you how to do them both easily. So yeah, if you could leave a like on the video, that would be awesome. Comment below what you get in the packs if you complete these SBCs. I hope you get a lot better than what I did, which you'll see in a moment. And um, yeah, thanks for watching. Enjoy the video and I will catch you in the next one. So the first SBC, Silent as the Grave. This one I found hard at first, but once you really just see how it's done, it's pretty easy. Now I don't advise you use the same players as I did, I've just pretty much used what's in my club. So up top we're going to go for a French Quartet. We're going to use Gignac because obviously French in a different league to League 1. We're going to use Gurkouf, who used to be amazing in FIFA. We're then going to use, I think it's Vinquia and Mete whose name I've probably got completely wrong as the other two cams. Now, Vinqui is being transferred to a centre mid, so that's something to be aware of. I had him as a centre mid from a previous team I used. Obviously, originally, he's a CDM, so that's something you'll have to watch out for. So, that is our top four. We're now going to work on the right side of the team, and we're going to go with some Spanish players. Now, once again, I'm going to say I don't advise you use the same players, just use the same method. At right back, we're going to use Mafia, who, when I looked on the market, is 600 coins. He might not be when you guys check. The two centre-backs are going to be two more Spanish players. We have uh, Mark Bartra and Insua. And then at CDM, we're going to get a player who gets a green link to Mafia at right back. And that'll get our chem up nicely. Um, you can pretty much go for any player from that team, but not a Spanish player. Because obviously, if you put too many Spain players in, then you're going to be over the limit for the requirements. At left back, we are going to go with the final Spanish player in the team, which is going to be Moreno of Liverpool. And then we're going to go with a Liverpool player, a CDM. It can be any Liverpool player. I'm just going with Jordan Henderson because he's in my club. Obviously, there are cheaper players available. So as you can see, that gets full chemistry. As you can also see, there is some players who have loyalty chem. Now, that's easily fixable. If you don't have the loyalty chem, just put players in the correct position because as you can see, I've got two players who are off chem due to their positions. So yeah, pretty simple one. And that's that one complete. Right then, so for Coven of Witches, what we're going to do is go get some Italians. As you could have probably guessed, we're going to put them up top. We are going to go with Gabbiadini and Quagliarella. Hope I haven't butchered his name too much. We'll then go with another Italian at right centre mid to link up the striker and the right back into the team. We're then going to go and get a Southampton player just to get... Um, to get Gabbiadini's chemistry up, and I believe it's going to be Tadic because uh, he's pretty much the only one that gets quick enough chem. Because if I use Shane Long, I'd have to use loads of position changes. Don't want to have to spend more coins. In the middle of the field, we'll go with a Premier League link, and we will use Leroy Fair, and we're going to use him to link up to some Air Divis boys. We're going to use a Hyperlink, which you'll see in a moment. Where is it? There it is. So we'll get Via Giver and Delict. Hopefully, I haven't ruined their names too much either. And then we'll go with an Eredivisie goalkeeper, we'll use this man, and boom, it's done. Some of the players do have loyalty chem, but as you can see, that's only like an extra 4 or 5 points, and we're well over 10 of other chemistry limits, so this one's actually really easy. Now I know a lot of people are going to try and get the high points to these locked cards, don't, you clearly don't need to, so, you know, save yourself some coins and hassle. Anyway, that's it done, and that one was pretty cheap to be honest, um, didn't have to buy anyone, but um, I don't imagine any of them players are going for particularly too much. So here are the rewards, as you can see, they're not too great. We get a Jumbo Gold Pack and a Gold Players Pack. We'll go for the Jumbo Gold Pack first, and hopefully, if we get boards in one of these, I'll be pretty happy. That'll be the dream, and as you can see, we're not even going to get a rare player, so not a good start. I hope your guys' packs are much better than mine, put it that way, because uh, that wasn't the ideal start. But, um... Yeah, I'm sure we can use some of these players in future SBCs. Nothing particularly of use in that pack, but we'll just shove it all in the club nevertheless. The final pack then, I mean, at least we're guaranteed a rare player. Hopefully it's a gold one. Please be a gold one. At least be a gold rare player, come on. Oh dear. Oh, well, we got a gold rare. That'll do. That'll do. We get, um, oh, oh, I thought it was going to be Jersey Outlaw. We get Bobby Wood. Of all players who featured in one of my original FIFA 18 videos, sir. Our packs, not the best, so I hope yours are a lot better than mine. 
But that's pretty much the end of the video. Just a quick one to show you how to do the SBCs if you were confused. If you have enjoyed this video or if it's helped you in any way, please remember to leave a like on it. Comment below what you got in your packs. Hopefully they were a lot better than mine. And apart from that, thanks for watching. And as always, I will catch you in the next one.